How's it going guys? It's Critical Fish here. I'm back doing another video today. Checking out my old Destiny 1 account. I've been watching quite a few Destiny 2 videos recently regarding the final expansion coming out for the game. It's like the 10th year of Destiny and it's coming pretty much to an end from what I understand so I've seen a lot of news around the game I kind of dropped off of Destiny 2 when Beyond Light came out and you know I played through the expansion I got stasis did the campaign did the raid and you know past that I wasn't really incentivized a lot to uh, keep going keep grinding you know, the weeklies and, uh, you know, community events and stuff. They just weren't super enticing. Um, I think by that point I had played probably for like five or six years. So I was kind of sick of it. And then all this news came out about the final shape and how it's been rushed um, how the pre-orders are extremely low compared to lightfall which was also low and uh, now now the game is kind of in a state that I'm not really sure I would enjoy in fact I know I wouldn't enjoy it so uh, I'm back on destiny one just to check out where I left off and what I got during those like three years of play. Man, this music is already classic. I remember hearing this like every damn day. All right, here we go. Here's my screen with all my characters on it. Um, I started as a warlock when I you know, first started playing the game uh, when I got Taken King. That's where I started. Learned the basics. Realized that Hunter was kind of my class to go with. And then I did a Titan character to uh, kind of wrap things up. Now, keep in mind, when I was playing this game, uh, I was hooked. <laughs> I mean, this was my only game for like two years besides Battlefront 2 and 1 and uh, I spent a lot of time playing this game getting perfect character armor and weapons so I think I have like 1600 hours total let's go ahead and get started and check out my hunter alright this is all looking familiar Here's the inventory. I want to check this out for a minute for sure. <sighs> Man, this is crazy. Oh, the music. Alright, so we're going to check this out. I think this was my favorite weapon to use. Um, this was from a new set of weapons and armor that released in the time that uh, Rise of Iron came out. And I think one day I got this roll from a bounty, if I remember. And uh, yeah, this is pretty much a perfect roll, besides the sights, I think. Or maybe this. This should have been something else, I think. But this is my favorite weapon, probably. I've got some other classics in here. Touch of Malice. Ooh, with the ornament, too. That's the original. That's the new one. Not sure if that's in Destiny 2. Grasp of Malik. This was a strike exclusive. Got a pretty decent roll here. This this took forever to get until uh, Skeleton Keys released, I remember. Doom of Kelkis. Oh, yeah, I forgot they did this thing. They took uh, some raid weapons and made them exotics for some reason. I forget why. Ooh, this is a big one. I remember getting this at like midnight 
um, from a random match, and it dropped with luck in the chamber, and I was freaking out. Very fun. We got the longbow. Whew. This, oh, this is probably my favorite sniper. So it's a, this is a decent roll for PvP and PvE, if I remember, because this is a PvP perk, and this works for PvE most of the time. Because um, I'm not that good. This, oh, Stolen Will, an amazing looking shotgun. This is a great perk, and that's a great perk too, so I think I used that for Crucible sometimes. Got the LDR. Nothing crazy here. Um, oh, this is a good Matador roll, but I don't think those were too hard to get. Got Icebreaker and Black Spindle. Ooh, let's see Icebreaker. That's pretty sick. And then we got the Gallahorn. That's amazing. Classic. And then all the swords and sleeper simulant. Ooh, that's my that's one of my favorite weapons for sure. I wish I had a real life model of this one because it's just so cool looking. And we got some good ghosts too. Chocolate. Ghost Ghost. And the Kingslayer shell. And then all my armor I think is uh Pretty, pretty good. Love the look of uh, my hunter with the Tanix cloak. Got a bunch of money left in here too, so, you know, that's a good lesson to know is that I'm a big saver. Got some quests. Ooh, the old map. This looks nice. I think I do prefer the uh, the Destiny 2 map, though. This does look pretty clean, though. It looks like it was hand-drawn. Got the moon, Venus, the reef, Earth, Mars, and the Dreadnought. Wow, there's really not that much in uh, Destiny 1. When you think about it. Let's go visit the tower. If you guys played Destiny 1 or Destiny 2, uh, let me know in the comments what do you think about both of the games or how do you view the franchise. Um, I know for me, I hopped on Destiny when I was starting out in high school. And uh, it was one of my first PS4 games. In fact, I think it was my second PS4 game, and uh, it was big. I did not expect a game like this to uh, really... Wow, this is crazy. This is crazy. Didn't really expect a game like this to grab my attention, but it, it was my favorite game for about two years, I think. Let me mute myself. We are in the Destiny 1 tower right now. And we've got the full traveler right there and the last city to look at in the distance, as well as the Destiny 2 tower somewhere over there. Um, yep, this is just, this is as classic as it gets for game hubs. Um, looks really cool, even today. This is probably better than the Destiny 2 tower. Let's check out the vault. I've got a lot of stuff in here. Only 108 item slots though, so let's see what I got. Patience and Time. Okay, that was my first exotic. Necrochasm, Thorn. Oh, Zen Meteor. This was a PlayStation exclusive, I think. Another Grasp of Malik in here. Fatebringer, I know that was a classic from uh, the Vault of Glass. Stranger's Rifle, 
Doctrine of Passing. Oh, this is a good page. Amago Loop, wow. That's pretty cool. Oh. The Unbent Tree, that's a great roll, if I remember correctly. Another Icebreaker, okay. No Land Beyond, awesome. Ooh, but not forgotten. That's a great roll. Hawk Moon. Another Imago Loop. Yeah, got some stuff. Got some cool stuff in here. What about armor? Yeah, got some stuff for sure. Damn, the 30 frames, you can definitely notice. That sucks. Are you ready? The hive bane. Go do what you do. This game also was not on PC. Which is kind of crazy now that I think about it. Um, if you haven't played Destiny 1, maybe uh, maybe you should check out check out Destiny 1 on console. It's definitely still fun and from what I can tell, it's active. So, that's pretty cool. Let's do some Clash. Oh, the loading takes a lot longer. Alright, here we go. Here's our team. Let's see how bad I am. Oh, the clever dragon. Here we go. Victory is a matter of will. This map kind of blows, though, if I remember. Oh my god, I'm so bad. Alright, let's get some headshots in, in here. Lead. No special ammo? What the hell? Oh, you gotta get it every time. Oh, almost. Oh shit, we got a guy right here. There we go, headshot. Oh my god, the FOV. <laughs> I'm doing the worst in the game right now. I gotta step it up for my team. But yeah, if I remember, I got flawless once. Um, not sure if it was in this game or it was in, if it was in D two, but I've definitely gone flawless once. Oh, almost got him. Most of the games I play now are just single player only, and um, you know I miss I miss feeling dedicated to a uh, 
like a multiplayer component of a game. I really haven't played much multiplayer since uh, this or Battlefront. Yes, you and your allies move as one. I hear a mighty multi tool. There we go. We take it. Can we get another super? There's still one though. Next fight. Oh, we got some legendary mark coins. Yeah, I mean, the combat is still pretty simple, but effective, and uh, I'm gonna assume the Destiny 2 version is a little more crazy than that, but it's still fun to see. What do we get? A moat. Nice. Well, I'm gonna call it at that, guys. If you wanna see more from me just hit the like and subscribe button i do all types of videos i collect video games um mostly physical but i keep it pretty limited um i've got some cool merchandise and uh collectible stuff for video games and uh, i might also start doing more more gameplay focused videos because i play games more than uh i collect them and uh, let me know if you want to see my Destiny 2 character, because I've got a whole nother Destiny character available. And uh, I could definitely show you a lot more there, because I've played that game for about four years, I think. So just let me know, and uh, Critical Fish, have a good one.